In this Resolve 16 video, I'm going to show you how you could set your Project Manager poster frame. That's the thumbnail that you see for your project when you open up your Project Manager. And you might notice that in some of them you only see one frame, and others you might see multiple ones. So in this video, I will show you how to determine which thumbnails are used as your poster thumbnails in the Project Manager. Okay, here I am in Resolve 16.2, and the project I actually have open right now is this first one here, and right now, as I scrub through, you'll see that there's only one thumbnail. So the reason there's only one thumbnail or one poster frame is because I only have one clip in my uh, media pool. So basically how it adds the different poster frames is each clip you add, and in order, it will add a new frame to your poster frame, and it actually has up to five different ones. So I'll demonstrate that now. So I'll add a second clip here. I'm going to add one of this lake picture here, lake clip, put that in the master. So now you can see I have two different clips. So if I come up to file and go to my project manager, if I move my mouse over, you see that it hasn't changed, but that's why it's highlighted in red and it has that red check mark on it. If I right click within the context menu here, I now have a update thumbnails. So if I click on that, that'll update the poster frames that are available. Now if I move over here, you'll see I have two different ones. So I have two different clips. So I can close that out. Now if I add a third clip here, which I will this house, these houses. So now I've added the woods, the lake, and these houses on the lagoon here in order. So I go back up to file and go to project manager. Again, if I don't refresh it, I just see the two. If I right click and go to update thumbnails and then go over top of it, I see all three of them, and you can do up to five. So I'll quickly add two more here. One, two, go back up to my media pool, go up to file, project manager, right click on it, click update thumbnails, and now as I scrub through, you'll see all five of them and they're in the order that I placed them in the media pool. Now I can demonstrate that by deleting these last two. Actually, I'll do these last three. So, the last three clips, I will delete them. And now I'll add them in a different order. So I'll do the green screen first. Then I'll add of this street, and then of the girls walking. Come up to master. Now I'll go to project manager again. So the order here is woods, lake, lagoon, girls, and green screen. Now, if I go and update thumbnails, see that's woods, lake, green screen now, car, and then girls. So hopefully that explains how you can set up your thumbnails or your poster frames for your project manager. Now within each clip you can't determine which one's going to be used so it does determine it kind of re resolve determines which frame from the clip it uses but you can determine uh, by which clips you put in and what order how they will appear and if you have more than five clips it'll use the first five so if you have 10 or 20 clips by how you like what order you add them to your media pool will determine which ones are used in your poster frames for your project manager. So hopefully you found this video useful and I thank you for watching.